WROK and the Royal Oak Hockey Club bring you Hockey Night in Royal Oak. Tonight in the Pee Wee Division, we have the Lions and the Wolves. This is Hugh Scullin along with Andy Aubrey bringing you tonight's contest here from the John Lindell Arena in Royal Oak. And we'll have the Lions and the Wolves in the Pee Wee Division. Take a look at the roster for the Lions first, Andy. All right, Hugh, thank you very much. Yep, we got the Pee Wee Lions. Uh, Joe Zwiak, that's Michael. He is number one. <clears throat> Samuel Pandole is uh, out this evening. This is Robert Yowell, but we're going to have number 12, John Butcher, out on the ice, as well as 13, Matthew Bujanovic. And number 21 is Adam Crow. 36, Matthew Senechel. 69, Connor Edwards. 79, Ethan Heckman. 91, Stephen Burke. And 99, Jake Foley. And we, have, we added another one. Nate Crane will be in goal for the Pee Wee Division. they borrowed from another team tonight. All right, so they signed him on a one-day contract. That's right. Okay, they're coached uh, by Anthony Heckman. And they are the Lions. Facing the Lions this evening. The one and only Wolves of the Royal Oak Hockey Club. We'll start off with the Wolves. Number two, Sam Schlossel. Number four, Jacob Schlossel. Number eight, Jack Armstrong. Number 11, Kevin Gruich. 12 is Harrison Fulbert. 13, Rachel Isaac. Number 14, Noah Bolger. 16 is Lindsey Walton. Number 17, Ian Suter. Number 23, Pearson Evans. Number 40, Ryan Hargrave Thomas. And number 45, we got Nicholas Calhoun this evening. They are the Wolves of the Pee Wee Division. Their head coach is Michael Bolger, and he's assisted by Gregory Fober. So there you have it. The Wolves, they're eight and five with zero ties. Our friends, the Lions, five and eight this year, also no ties. And this is it, Hugh. This is our last game of the year, right? Yeah, this is the last, last, last weekend of the last week of the year for. Uh, for this the Royal Oak Hockey Club. I got a I got another number in oh these series. I got I, I thought I had another player in there, but uh, yeah, these uh these teams we've seen these teams a lot this year and uh we're uh they're used to playing against each other. <laughs> uh, Are they sick and tired of playing against each other? Maybe, yeah. Yeah they um the last two times we were out here the, the Wolves won ten to four and and lost 13 to 5. So, I mean, I, I think that's what this says here. What does that tell you about these teams? Almost uh, nothing, right? Uh, they're, they're, uh, they're evenly balanced. They're think, evenly yeah. balanced, and they each had an off night. Uh, so, we'll uh, get started in just a moment. Uh, they, I think they're waiting. I don't, don't think the goalie, they borrowed a goalie. I think the goalie's not here, getting the pads on. So That was uh, a lot of material. Equipment to get put on him there, so. There's a lot of uh, people our director looking is, around. Our director is, resp is, is volunteering to come out and be the goalie. Richard Wilson, he got game, okay? <laughs> Don't underestimate him. He'll get out there. <laughs> He's got that butterfly move down. He can get down and get back up again in under five minutes. My problem, would, my problem would be, wouldn't be getting down. It would be getting back up. <laughs> yeah, the getting down is not the problem. That happens all the time. Yeah, get, getting, getting up, up is the problem. Is, is the issue. <laughs> oh, love it. Love it, love it. The fun we have here. And, hey, here comes Crane. The goaltender has arrived. He's in the building. Okay. Not much warm-up time for him, but. That, that's Nate Crane. Is that right? I get the. And Nate Crane underway. is in the goal. So Nate oh, Crane's right. our guy out there. Okay. Right. Okay. Puck loose in center ice and uh, picked up there by the Lions. Lions, Burke skating it in. Burke's got Butcher with him. Burke shot on the net. Gruwich makes the save. Rebound not, goes off the side of the net. Coming out. Doesn't get it out and shot back in there by Connor Edwards, I believe. To get back there, Jake Foley trying to center it. 
around behind the net. Going over there, pick it up is Jack Armstrong. Shot back in, in front. The defense breaks it up in front and skates it out to center ice. Evans with it. Evans, and he's met and stopped at the blue line. And the Lions take it back over. We're having trouble clearing it out. And, uh, He's past the coach there. The coach is leaning over. I can't see where he is. He's trying to shout. Tries to get to it, but Rachel Isaac meets it there. He's over to Jack Armstrong, but the, the Lions bring it back in. Get to get a center sent. And went in the net, I think. Yeah, that's a goal. Take a look at that. I didn't see how it got in there, but it got in there. Yeah, let's take another look, Hugh, figure out what happened here. It was sort of an innocent play. And darn if that thing didn't just skitter across uh, through the goaltender and into the net for our first goal of this game. It is one to nothing. John Butcher unassisted. Lion uh, come right back. The will come right back with it. The Lions coming out. Wojnovic coming out to center right. There's nobody puts it along the board. Going back there to pick up Rachel Isaac. Still picked up and drove, but now the, the Wolves get it and stay to center ice. Sam Schlessel. Sam Schlessel skating it in. Sam Schlessel shot knocked away by Crane. Along the board. Trying to clear it. It gets out. And it gets out. Bolger couldn't keep it in. Bolger wheels back. Waits for his teammates to clear. Shoots it ahead to Jacob Plessel. Jacob Plessel tries to center it in front, and Crane grabs it and holds on. Face off will be to the glove side of goaltender Nate Crane. Now, Hugh, you know these teams real well. Um, uh, yeah. This is more probably better than you ever dreamed you would. <laughs> But the Wolves have a number of ladies on the team. How they've been performing this year? They're very well. These teams, these teams have been pretty well balanced. Uh, you know, it's uh, they've been <laughs> they've been very competitive. Oh, let's see. Do I get? They're coming out now. I think that, uh, that John Butcher takes it down the ice. Wait, ice icing waved off. Gone back there, pick it up. Matthew Senechal. Senechal tries to center it. Broken up in front there by Evans. But shot back in. Faubert picks it up. Harrison Faubert puts it up along the board to Evans. Evans comes down. Evans looking for the opening. Evans gets past it. Shot goes in on Crane. Crane grabs it and holds on. And a nice job of Crane holding on to that puck. No rebound which can be dangerous, <laughs> give the other team a second opportunity, but Evans was rolling across that line. He had a head of steam. He's a good sized hockey player there. He seems to stand above some of the others. Really short benches here. Like we got you know, just three subs on one bench and four on the other. Took him down. Skating it in there. With, and then get the number on that. Back over the other side, now picking it up, Wolves. Trying to clear it. And the Slussel, but picked back up now. Sam Slussel trying to get it loose, but picked up there by, I got a number 15. Who's the number 15? I don't have a 15 on my roster there. I don't have a 15 on there. Ooh, there's another one. Goal is in. Yeah, that's the rebound. We talked about it just a minute ago. The Crane was able to sort of hold on to the puck. And makes the initial save, and that was all well and good, but the uh, rebound sort of bounced out in front of him, and suddenly we have a 2 nothing game. Uh, 15 is Michael Joswiak. He's not wearing number one. And 15, goal, Michael Joswiak from uh, number 13, Matthew Vujinovic, and number 79, Ethan Heckman. 
Ooh. That time he does cover up. So the... Now the last time I can recall we were out here, the, the uh, Wolves really scored a lot of goals and mostly by Sam Schlussel. So let's see what happens tonight. Well, that's been all well, Lions, sir. That's been all the Lions. Now, now it's out the center. Right? Going down the ice. Edwards going back after it. Edwards being chased back to everybody, number 23, Pearson Evans. Edwards puts it up along the boards, but kept alive there by Jack Armstrong. Puts it alongside the net. Now you get it to center ice. Going back to pick it up is Rachel Isaac. Isaac shoots it ahead. It's a, Sam Schlussel picks it up, but taken away from him by Burke. Schlussel takes it back. Sam Schlussel. Mm. We've seen Slant Sam before. He's got pretty good moves. And as he goes down and Ooh. shot at that time, it's blocked by Crane. Back here, Faubert picks it up. Shoots it in behind the net to Schlussel, but can't get to it. And back down the ice, it comes for the Lions. Butcher. Butcher breaks it loose from Bolger, but now picked up here, back taken away by Schlussel. Sam Schlussel to Jacob Schlussel and knocked off the puck there by, I believe that, that's uh, Ethan Heckman. Now back out to center right. Bolger can't keep it in. Bolger gives it ahead to Sam Schlussel. Back. Sam Schlussel picks it up back, back up again and Calhoun shoots it again. I don't have four. Do I have 45 on there? Oh, Nicholas Calhoun. Calhoun, no, right. right. <clears throat> so that's the Schlesel to Schlesel line. Right. Yeah, they're, they, I, we were corrected last week when we thought they were brothers, that they're actually cousins. They're cousins. Okay. okay so. Still one of the all-time great yeah. production yeah. lines yeah. in Royal Oak Hockey Club history, yeah. of which yeah. the year is only about one year of history. But... <laughs> Bolger. Ooh, Heckman, he, Heckman picks it up. Somebody goes down hard. That was, I think that, that was Nicholas. Oh no, that was uh, that was number 15. 15 Mike, and Mike, Michael Joswiak. Joswiak went down into the boards. Back into center ice, picking it up. Joswiak trying to get it started. Finally, does get it started. Joswiak skating it in, knocked off his stick by Rachel Isaac. He gets it back again, looking to center it. Flips it up and taken away there and coming down the I-7. Pearson Evans. Pearson Evans going in all alone. Shot knocked away, but the rebound. Pearson Evans put it in. Well, Gal and Effort on the back check there. The uh, We're taking another look at it. Nice move, sort of a bit of a hesitation. Pulled the goalie, went down. Crane went down, and by then he was... At the mercy. Well, the rebound Levin. was there, and he, he, he poked it in. Yeah, and Crane had been able to cover that up prior to that particular opportunity. Not that time. Senechow, real quickly, Matthew Senechow comes down and knocks it in. Well, the goals are coming fast and furious. Hope you got your uh, couple extra pens on you, Hugh. These things are, uh, and you took the over, too, by the way. <laughs> with 3.15 to play in the first period, it's already 3-1. Three 3-1 to one. Three to one for the Lions in this one. They come down and pick it up. Butcher shoots it in. Buckle on the boards, and Sam Schlussel tries to come out with it, taken away by Butcher, but taken back there by Faubert. Faubert ahead. To Jacob Flussel. Jacob Flussel puts it around behind the net. Going in there to get at the Lions. Trying to clear it. They do get it out the, out the center. Bolger trying to get it back the other way and it picked up here. Coming down Burke. Burke, nice move. Gets around one defender but forced to the boards with it. Puck in back. Bolger trying to get control. But set up in front there. Foley drops it out. Nice pass in front to uh, Butcher, but broken up in front there by Jacob Schlussel. Sam Schlussel coming back the other way. Sam Schlussel. 
Drop back there, Noah Bolger. Keeping it in at the point. Back out here to the point again, and again, Bolger keeps it in. Keeps it alive, and in front of the net, into Jacob Slussel. Jacob Slussel's go shot goes wide. Right there, Butcher picking it up. But Faubert, Harrison Faubert puts it back in, goes in behind the net. The Lions come out to try and clear it. Put it up along the boards, but Bolger again, keeping the pressure on, keeping it in. Head to Calhoun. And now it's out the center ice. Here comes Senechow, Matthew Senechow with it. He's got one man to get around. He does get around. Nice pass across to Butcher. Shot is deflected by Jacob Slussel. Jacob Slussel out ahead to Sam Slussel. To Evans. And shot back in. Evans picks it up. Evans picks it up in center right. Being checked there by Vujinovic. And back in it. Heckman gets it, gets it out ahead. Ahead to Joswiak. Joswiak. And Rachel Isaac breaks that up at the blue line. Back ahead to Evans. To Noah Bolger. Bolger. To Sam Schlussel at the blue line. Schlussel, the round one defenseman. Gets around the second defenseman, puts the shot in. And the save made by Nate Crane. And Sam Schlesel, not a player that's looking to pass first. He appears to be comfortable with the puck on the end of his stick as he dances around player after player. And he's he's got some nice moves. He's got pretty good moves. He, <laughs> Nate Bolger, or Noah Bolger, shoots it, but broken up there by number 13, Matthew Vujnovic. Vujnovic gets it to center right. Vujnovic goes down to pass Evans, goes in deep. Coming in and holding it in. Senechow. Senechow sends it across the ice to Crow too far. Rachel Isaac gets it out to center ice. And going back there. Ethan Heckman going back after it. Connor Edwards is out there. I had I him down to 69. He's number 66. I just see that. Well, they're just messing with us all over the roster. Yeah, here, right. Yeah, just what do we do to deserve this? Yeah, we got... Uh, And sign up at seven seconds remaining or eight seconds remaining here in the first period. The shot goes right towards the net. And Joswiak shot in the net with two seconds remaining. Michael Joswiak, his second goal. Well, we'll see what happens here. The time was running out. It looked like the Wolves were going to get out of this one without any more damage, but alas, with 2.6 seconds left to play. And the goal by number 15, Michael Joswiak, the assist goes to number 13, Matthew, Vujno Matthew Vujnovic. And it's a four to one lead for the Lions going into the second period. They go over and get some instructions from their benches and be ready to go with the second period. And you mentioned it, Hugh, these benches are short tonight. These kids are gonna sleep well. There's a lot of up and down action going on, and and the Wolves have all got a bit of a puzzled look on their face at the moment. They find themselves in a four to one hole here as we uh, regroup during this first intermission. Both sides getting some much needed coaching, and and uh, it has been all Lions up till this point. There's so. no. Uh there, there will be no complaints from any line tonight about ice, about ice time. <laughs> no, no. Oh, no, no. No, they're going to be asking to come off the ice as a matter of fact. I didn't get enough ice time, Coach. And yeah. Nobody's going to say that tonight. <laughs> no, they are not. They will be um, panting. Here's Sam Schlussel to take the face off against John Butcher. Referee will get ready to start and to go. Oh, and Nate Crane wasn't in the goal yet, so. Yeah, he needs to do that. And for somebody who just jumped on the ice literally seconds before we drop the puck start this game, he's fared pretty well. He's only given up one goal. Yeah. And his defense has been strong. They've been forcing the play at the other end of the ice. Sam Slussell takes the draw, but taken back away by John Butcher. Butcher skates it in, but broken up there by Rachel Isaac. Back to center ice to Slussell. Shot back the other way. Offside. And 
the faceoff will come up right out to the red line. Jacob Schlussel with the puck in center ice. Looking to get started, but met, stopped there at the blue line. Shot back the other way. Faux Bear couldn't get to it. Hey, Rachel Isaac back to pick it up for the wall. Puts it up along the boards, but Butcher's there to break it up. Butcher drops it back to Heckman. Heckman shot. It deflected. Butcher picks it up. With a circle. Butcher shot. Deflected. Back out to the point. Burke. Burke shot. Goes off a defenseman. And back into the corner. And cleared out and down the ice. That's going to go on the net. So that's not going to be an icing. Yeah. Puck rolled all the way down. Yeah. How did that happen? That would have been an icing had, had it not gone right on the net. Rachel Isaac. But broken up there and picked up there, number 79, Ethan Heckman. Back, back the other way. Slussel, Slussel. Looking for an opening. Slussel shot is deflected. And the Lions trying to come away. Rachel Isaac puts it back in. Jacob Slussel puts it in behind the net. Sam Slussel back there to pick it up. Sam Slussel, but taken away by the defense. Jacob Slussel puts it right across in front. And back. Can't clear it. Uh, Jake Foley can't clear it now. This time they're going to get it out to center ice to center chow. Center chow. Got one to beat. Got, got Butcher with him, but Fobear, nice defensive move, poked, poked it away. Heckman. Heckman shot. Broken up by Faux Bear. He tries to get it ahead, but Heckman breaks it up, shoots it back the other way. Foley into the corner. Rachel Isaac and Senechow go back to battle for it. Pearson Evans comes away with it. Pearson Evans trying to get it cleared. Pearson Evans through the middle. Gives it up to Jacob Slussel, to Sam Slussel. And knocked off his stick by Heckman. Jacob Slussell gets it back again. Heckman breaks it up. Bolger keeps it in at the point. Pearson Evans, bouncing shot. Goes wide. Cleared up along the board. Battle for it there. Jozwiak comes away with it. Jozwiak. Gives it ahead to his teammate, but Pearson Evans back to pick it up. But... Pearson Evans going back the other way to Jacob Slussel. Jacob Slussel, or Sam Slussel. And shot in by Sam Slussel. Well, it was only a matter of time before we saw that. He had made a nice couple of runs earlier in the game, and this was a breakaway that he makes no mistake with. He goes right over the right shoulder of Crane to draw his team. To within two goals now, it's four to two with 6.51 left to play in the second. The goal, Sam Schlussel, the assist to number 23, Pearson Evans. Yeah, with all this ice time, you're bound to pump up your stat sheet too. Oh yeah, right? well, that's right. Bojanovic, <laughs> Bojanovic gets around Bolger, but Bolger back to pick it up. Bolger can't clear it. Shot from the point there by Burke. And uh, Kevin Gruich grabs it and holds on. The, uh, the Lions looking to get going. Joswiak is down. We're going to have a penalty coming up here. The Wolves are going to go to, in the penalty situation. So we're going to have. Well, it's not what head coach Michael Bolger wanted to see. It's going to be a trip here on uh, <clears throat> at the 617 mark. Ryan Hargrave Thomas. At 617 of the second period. And the Wolves have been playing with a little greater sense of urgency, which they needed to do. They were down three goals as we started the second. So they're man down now. Burke shot. Down. Advantage. 
The Lions with the advantage of Vucinovic keeps it alive. They get it out the center right to Sam Schlussel. Sam Schlussel, short-handed. Sam Schlussel goes in and poked away. Good poke check there by Burke. And now the Lions pick it up. Try to get their rush started. Off the boards. I think that's going to be an icing. That's going to be an icing as Edwards shot it too far down the ice. And that's going to, the faceoff is going to come back into the Lions end. Well, you hate to see an icing like that on a power play. Still 124 left in the penalty. 4 to 2 is our score. 540 to play in the second. Faceoff comes back down deep in the Lions zone. Controlled by the Wolves, but no Bolger shot is deflected by the defense and shot down the ice, and that's going to take some time off that penalty. Gruwich puts it aside that for Jacob Slussel puts it along the boards, but in the forecheck there, they almost took it away. Coming back here comes Sam Slussel with it. The shorthanded situation out in front, but knocked away, but shot back in there, and he got the rebound and put it right in on Nate Crane, but Nate held on. Another one of those good holds for Crane. He's been doing that all game so far. No rebounds, and you'd never even know that the Wolves had a penalty, a uh, player in the penalty box. With a guy like Schlussel, he's taking this game into his own hands. Basically a nice rush there. Point blank shot, not able to put it in. Pearson Evans shot goes around behind the net. Foley picks it up there. Gets it out to center ice, ahead to Senechal. Senechal's got one to beat. But good back check there by Pearson Evans. Come back and Pearson Evans taking it away. Pearson Evans, again on the shorthanded situation. Pearson Evans down, down the ice. Gets right out in front. Shot up over the net. Tried to lift it, he lifted it just a little too high. Bolger, Bolger shot. Does get through and knocked away by Crane. I don't know how it got through all those legs, but it did. Pearson Evans keeping it alive. Edwards gives it ahead to Senechow. Senechow and Bolger collide and go down. No penalty. It was inadvertent contact there. Heckman goes back into center ice. Butcher waits for Heckman to clear. He's back in the other end, and Noah Bolger trying to clear it. But Heckman keeps it alive. Heckman puts it over the opposite wing. Foley. Foley. But Rachel Isaac clears it down. Shot back in. Swept aside. Heckman picks it up. Heckman. Shot goes off Bolger. Back to Butcher at the point. Butcher shot. Goes off somebody in front. Foley picking it up. Foley back. Trying to backhand it. To Senechow. They're taking away. Pearson Evans picks it up. Pearson Evans gives it out ahead. And... Butcher breaks it up there, but Ryan Hargrave Simon tries to pick it up. Shot back in, but and they were in the process of a move, and Senechow was offside as he was trying to get off the ice on a change. Four well, to two, the Lions lead this one. Yeah, and the Wolves have uh, shown greater resolve here. Uh, certainly, in light of that, one of the most anemic power plays you'll ever see in that last opportunity the, the Lions had. But uh, four to two, this thing's still up in the air. Well, I think that's part part of the you know, the penalty kill for uh, for the Wolves of getting getting opportunities for themselves on it. Yeah, I think their move was just forced to play at that point. Yeah, and they did. Chazwiak wheeling back to center, but taken away by Jacob Schlesel. Shot back the other way. Harrison Fobert picks it up. Fobert ahead to Sam Schlesel. But broken up, taken away there by Burke. Now, now back to Schlussel, and he's met and stopped there by Heckman. But back in there, and the Schlussel is it going in this time. That's it's up goal. and in, in wow. the net. Well, don't look now. We got a one-goal game here. Yeah, it's back. Let's see how this happened. It was uh, sort of an innocent enough looking run, but he held it and held it and held it. And Sam Schlessel with another goal for the Wolves to draw yet closer. It's four to three here. Yeah, the assistants go to Jacob Schlessel and uh, Jack Armstrong. And there's Schlessel again. 
Broken up by Joswiak. Now Vujnovic picks it up. Vujnovic getting, scooting it in, and Kevin Gruich makes the save and holds on. Yeah, the Lions said we'll have enough of that. Let's uh, see if we can turn this thing around and sort of stretch out. They've been stuck on four for quite a while at this point. Jacob Russell breaks it up, but shot back in by Burke. Goes off the defense. Wisnovich puts it ahead. Now pick up, picked up again here. And Joswiak keeps it alive, puts it into the corner. We got a, we got a penalty coming up. Are you okay? Somebody went down. I didn't see the. Somebody's still down, it looks like. He's rolling around out there. It's, we can't catch him on from our vantage point, but he's laying on his back, getting attended to. And Jacob Schlesel is gonna is gonna go into the box here. So we're not quite sure what happened. There was a collision, and he's sitting up now. So that's good news. We're giving him a round of applause. As we act. So the Wolves once again. Find themselves playing one down. And, uh, you know, that could be good news for them. Last time they had a power, or uh, they were a player short, they forced to play the entire two minutes, it seemed. That was a, a two minute minor for a check. A, this is not a checking league. Oh. So you got. The Lions with the man advantage. Out in front, Butcher's shot. Deflected the side. Foley puts it in. Broken up there by Bolger. Foley gets it back. Puts it back in the front. Armstrong picks it up for, for the Wolves. Tries to get it to Faubert, gets it to Bolger. Back there and Butcher picks it up at the point. Butcher skates it in and goes down. Now, picking it up, Pearson Evans trying to clear it. But kept alive by Senechow. Faubert shot back in there and Bolger down, down to pick it up. Noah Bolger to head to Armstrong. Bolger picks it back up. Bolger gets it out to center ice. Bolger down the right wing. Goes off the skate of Ethan Heckman. Then behind the net there, coming out with it is Connor Edwards. But Bolger keeps it alive. Bolger to Pearson Evans. Puts it into the corner. Butcher going back after it. Butcher trying to come out of his own end. Then he sends it out, but Pearson Evans breaks it up there. Back into center ice for Senechow. Rachel Isaac picks it up. Gives it ahead to Armstrong, but broken up and taken away by the, the uh, Lions. Butcher puts it into the corner. Going back there, that is Noah Bolger. Folger coming out from behind his own net, but Foley on the four check taking it away. Folger gives it up to Pearson Evans, but not far enough. Ethan Heckman. Now Pearson Evans trying to come out with it. He does. Shot back the other way there by Butcher, but one of his teammates hadn't cleared, so offside. Well, 30 seconds left, 15 seconds left in the Lions power play of which once again they have yet to really mount much of an offensive attack during. And the Wolves in the meantime keep creeping back into this thing. It's been the tale of two games in these two periods so far. Wisnovich controls the faceoff over to Joswiak, but broken over by Rachel Isaac. Wisnovich gets it back. Wisnovich look, looking to skate in with it. Puts it over and crosses in front of the net. Nobody there to get a stick on it. No, the Wolves come out with it. Coming out to center ice. On the down there, and Sam Slussel got it in, but got taken away from him there. And going back the other way with it was Wojnovic. That's going to end the second period. The score, the Lions four and the Wolves three. So we've got a good contest now. As the Lions went into that period with a four to one lead, and uh, the Wolves are catching up. Yeah, they're slowly losing their grip. I don't think either side's going to score 12 goals tonight. We are not no. going to see that type of out, uh, offensive output, but 
Uh, both teams playing well, pretty evenly matched. You mentioned it before the game started. They were two real one-sided games with each side getting the uh, the victories. But tonight, 4-3 to three so far as we enter the third period. The Wolves started out like gangbusters, or the Lions rather. Wolves been able to catch up here slowly and with a, only a one point, one goal advantage for the Lions at the moment. They need to uh, get that jump back in their step here as this third period begins. We're ready for the start here. and. Uh Picked up there by Jacob Slussel, shoots it in. Connor Edwards going back after it. Edwards puts it up along the board, trying to clear it. To Viznovic, they can't get it cleared. And this time to throw and back, back in in front to Calhoun. And now the Lions break out. Burke, Burke, he's got Viznovic with him. Burke shot. And Gr Kevin Gruich goes down, was going for that five hole, and Gruich went down and covered it up. Well, as we begin to cycle through this third period, it's going to be real interesting to see how the fatigue factor plays a part in this game. And I expect to see some pucks overskated and some missed passes and, and some odd man rushes here as we move along because these benches are so short and these players have been on the ice almost the entire game with two or three exceptions of them. I'm not sure they ever get tired at this age. Well, you might be right. <laughs> or they don't that. ever admit it anyway. <laughs> yes. Well, what happens between then and now then? Because I'm exhausted. That's right. Yeah. And we're just standing here. Oh. oh. Wicked angle. I think that uh, Foley was standing right there on the doorstep, but he never got to him. It went in before. Let's see if we yeah. can get a look at it. That, that was amazing. Yeah, yeah. That came from a wide, very, very extreme angle. And I don't know that anybody expected that. And it just uh, snuck in there. Jake Foley was expecting to have to do something with it. But all he ended up having to do was raise his hands up, celebrate with his teammates. I think it was in the net. Yeah, the goal goes Matthew Senechow from uh, Connor Edwards and uh, John Butcher. Bolger clears it in the center ice. Burke picks it up. Gets it in. Bolger trying to clear it. Can't get it out. Back into the corner. And the Lions trying to keep the pressure on and add to their lead. And right out in front there. Bolger now trying to pick it up and clear it. But can't get it away. Burke. Connor Edwards gives it back to Burke. Bolger breaks it up, Armstrong back there, and they still keep it alive. Goes over to the opposite wing, and there was nobody there on defense to stop that one. But they are still controlling, having trouble getting it out. Pearson Evans finally gets it down the ice. No icing. Connor Edwards going back after it for the Lions. Edwards up to Senechow. He gives it ahead in uh, rush for the Lions. That's Butcher. John Butcher shot. Knocked away. Still trying to keep it alive. Pearson Evans trying to get it to center ice. Finally gets it ahead to Samuel, uh, Sam Schlussel. Sam Schlussel. Sam Schlussel going down. Nobody else with him. He's the only blue shirt there. He tries to center it back out in front. And we've got another penalty coming up. We've got a hooking coming up. Well, this will be the first power play of the night for the Wolves. That's just what they needed. They're still down two. We've got 7.24 to play in the third period. They were had cut it to one before the Lions scratch another one across here in this third period. And the penalty is two, two minutes to Connor Edwards for hooking. Ethan Heckman trying to clear it. Colbert back to pick it up at the point. And shut in. I don't know where, who, who got the shot. We'll see who. I think maybe was, I think it was Jacob Slussel, but we'll we'll see. Four, 
45. Hmm. Okay. Nicholas Calhoun yeah. from Jacob Plussel and Harrison Faubert. Well, that was one of the few rebounds that Crane gave up. And you see what happened. He, okay. uh, they ended up burying the rebound and pulled to within one again. We got a heck of a game on our hands here. Five to four now. That was a quick power play. <laughs> was, yeah, that's the way they draw them up. That was, uh, that was about uh, 17 seconds, I believe, in the power play before the goal was scored. Jacob Slussel holds it at the line. And Whoa. in the net, from, from the blue line, Jacob Slussel, they come, they come back to tie this one up. We got a game, Hugh, five to five. How much fun is this? That one came from long range, unlike some of these others, with the rebound at the doorstep. Crane's not a very big player, so he's got a lot of net to cover there, and yeah, as opposed to his counterpart down at the other end of the ice. I don't know if that took a funny bounce or what. I think it, it did. It, 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 it. Yeah, it sort of skittered across the ice after it hit. Wojnowicz shot goes in behind the net. Bolger trying to clear it. Armstrong loses the edge, goes down. Crow keeping it in. In behind the net. Battle for it. Now come Pearson Evans is going to pick it up and take it out. Pearson Evans has got Armstrong with him. Armstrong is in. Burke breaks it up, but not out. And now they do get it out at center ice. Noah Bulger back to pick it up. Bulger going to center ice. Is it ahead to Armstrong too far? Armstrong going in to get it, but the Lions trying to clear it. Burke in behind his net. Trying to come out, but broken up and now kept in by Bolger at the point to Evans. Pearson Evans shot goes right out in front. It goes right down there and Nate Crane covers it up. He tried to sweep it aside, but the whistle had already blown. If you're going to make the save and sweep it aside, you can't cover it with your glove. Right, you can't do both. That's like uh, calling for a fair catch yeah. on a punt <laughs> and right. then running. Yeah, you can't do both. If you're going to, if you want to sweep it aside, don't cover it with your glove. <laughs> Sam Slussell looking for an opening. So, in the net again. So they came, have come from behind. Three unassisted. And they have taken their first lead of the night with 5.27 to play. It's now 6-5 to five after being down 4-1. to one. They've come and roared all the way back. Despite their uh, discrepancy on penalties, they've had more uh, box time than the Lions, but they've come back, and now they take the lead. Slusso comes out. He's going to get a break, but got one defenseman back. Look at the shot. Kick save there by Nate Crane. Up the center. Bolger keeps it alive. To Calhoun. Calhoun tries to backhand it. Butcher back there picks it up for the Lions. Butcher. Butcher gives it ahead to Senechow. Senechow into center ice. Going back there, pick up Rachel Isaac. They get it back the other way. Here comes Burke. Ooh, Burke, but taken away there by Bolger. Burke takes it back. Burke skating it in. Burke off Jacob Slussell's stick. Again, Jacob Slussell blocks it with his stick. Slussell puts it around, all the way around to the opposite side to Sam Slussell. Sam Slussell skating it in. Looking we'll for the shot. Goes in behind the net. Centers it oh. out in front to Calhoun. Couldn't get the stick on it. Rachel Isaac keeps it alive. Butcher back there picking it up. It gets out the center ice, gets ahead to Burke. Burke, Burke, looking in there. But good back check, great back check by Noah Bolger. Yeah, Bolger came out of nowhere to save that play for his side. Butcher shot, goes off the skate of Burke. Couldn't get out of the way, center child shot, knocked away. Foley back there trying to get it, but Michael Pearson Evans is gonna pick it up for us. For the Wolves. Back out into center ice. They're coming down the ice now. Jacob Slussell. Jacob Slussell wheels. Backhanded shot across in front of the net. 
Back in behind the net and the Lions trying to clear it. Sam Slussell battling for it there. Rachel Isaac keeps it alive for the Wolves. Now shot down the ice. And they're going to be an icing. It's going to bring it all the way back into the Lions end. 312 remaining. The Wolves lead this one six to five after trailing in the, at the end of the first period, four to one. Yeah, it's been all Wolves ever since, really. The uh, I don't know if the Lions figured they had this thing won or not, but it was only four to one, and it was still pretty early. So uh, with only scratching one more goal across, they've watched the Wolves surpass them. Still 3.06 to play, though, with a one goal advantage. Armstrong shot, shot off the side of the net. Pearson Evans circles in front. Pearson Evans shot, knocked away by Nate Crane. Armstrong to have to pick it up. Armstrong gives it to Pearson Evans. Pearson Evans in behind the net. Look at the center it. Centers it in front, nobody can get a stick on it. Armstrong and Vujnovic go over a battle for it. And, but Harrison Faubert keeps it in. And Ethan Heckman trying to clear it. But they haven't been able to get it out. Kept alive there, Evans picks it up. Evans skates it in. Evans shot, goes across, knocked across in front. And the Wolves are keeping pressure on since they took the lead. Ryan Hargrave Thomas shot, goes off the defense. Pearson Evans shot, goes deflected by the defense. Back out to the point, Harrison Faubert picks it up. Faubert gives it ahead, but too far. Back in there, Ethan Heckman trying to pick it up and get it cleared. Gets it up to Vujnovic, but too far, Faubert keeps it alive. Heckman clears it down the ice. That's going to be an icing. That was a little frustration. You, you couldn't get it cleared, so you shed it down the ice, but now you've got a now you've got an icing to contend with. Back still in your own zone. Yeah, that was a little bit of frustration. They were really having a hard time with all wolves these last few minutes. Those goals really sort of energized them. And even when they were down four to one, it didn't feel like they were defeated by any means. They uh, they were circling the wagons and trying to figure out how to get back in this thing, which they have done. Calhoun tries to put it toward the net. The defense knocks it away. Center Chow tried to clear it. Can't get it out. Now they do get it to center ice and Butcher. Butcher down the ice. Got to it before it got to that blue line for an icing. Back in behind the net. Center Chow tries to center it. Heckman shot. Big shot from close in. As he's trying to Back along the boards here, back out the center ice. Ethan Heckman flips it back in. Faubert picks it up there. Can't clear it. Faubert can't get it out again. They're, they're, now Butcher's got it. Butcher's in front. Shot. <laughs> Blocked in front by the defenseman, Noah Bolger. Bolger picks it up. Goes down. Sent out in front. Butcher, or that's uh, Wisnovich. Lots of bodies flying everywhere now. Senechal to Butcher. Butcher's shot is deflected aside. Back in there now. Faubert to Bolger. Bolger and Senechal battle for it. Coming away. Pearson Evans gets it. Pearson Evans. It came out over the line. Burke tried to hold it in at the blue line, but just came out over the blue line. Yeah, it crept over by about three or four inches, and they had some good pressure on there in this last minute of play. They did everything but score to try and tie this game. They're still down one goal. Now we're down to 27 seconds left. And they pulled the goalie, so they got the extra skater. With 27 seconds, they got the extra skater on the ice. Wojnovic. Flips it ahead to Butcher. Too far now. Shot down the ice. And that's going to be icing, so it's going to come back into the Wolves' end. You don't want to ice it there. You want to get it out of the zone, but you don't want to ice it. So. Yeah, something along the sideboards. Maybe just dump it out a little bit, but they shot it down the ice, and that might have been their own brand of relieving the pressure just to get it out of there for right now let them sort of catch their breaths. 
trying to keep it alive, but they're coming. Jacob Schlussel and Noah Bolger, Noah Bolger, they get it to center ice, and Burke's going back after it. Burke gives it up to Butcher. Butcher's shot. He's broken up, and like Rachel Isaac breaks that last shot up, and that's going to be the game. The Wolves come away with the win. The Wolves six, and the Lions five. This is Juice Cohen with a, along with Andy Aubrey with Richard Wilson, our crew out here in, the, in here on the cameras and out there in the truck. Want to thank you for tuning in to Hockey Night Royal. Good night, everybody.